all right folks do a video swapping out cable ends um, getting rid of this open end uh, cable clevis I don't like them they're junk I can't find a hook to go through it that isn't super big and clevises don't work uh, so especially for heavy applications the clevis is always too big or too little so we're swapping it out with these closed in ones got them they're new the Crosby's um, I got them from a place in town that had them for like 30 bucks so 7 8 cable I'm gonna use the car the Crosby wire lock to uh, get it set up on the end so we're gonna go ahead and start got the cable cut off I sprayed it with degreaser it was a little nasty it's a tight fit on that end so I'm gonna get them cleaned up a little bit first and uh, we'll slide the end on and go from there all right once you get on there I marked it a little differently. Uh, I'm actually gonna take it out and knock it a little more. But the cable's so stiff for seven eighths. It's not much fun. But uh basically put a screwdriver in here, try this over when you beat it down some more. I bet it comes out and then we'll get it all broomed out. It's for you to get it. Before you broom it, you want to chain through it. So that when you hook on or whatever, you can pull it against itself to pull this back down inside of here. You can do it by hand, but with this cable with this coating on it, so it's going to get cleaned up, others won't. So, go ahead and get it out like that. And spray it and clean it up. Hook your cable up. Chain. Two piece uh, wire lock set resin and a mixture should look like this. Put your screwdriver in there and move a few more around, make it a little bit more fill. And uh, we'll mix these and pour. Get done mixing it, should be a green color. And pour it. I'm pour a little minute ago. I had to hold my hand right with the camera. Really kind of a pain. So once you get in there, kind of stand it up because it's not a very good issue. The cable's so stiff. So once you put putty down here, sometimes to keep from leaking down through. But I just use a hose clamp. It keeps it pretty stiff on that cable. So, for 7 8 cable, you need 125 cc's per, um, per one, so, put a little more in it. Alright folks, still gelling a little bit, so it's about 20 minutes of gelling, and it should be set up within an hour to use, so, and then you got a scratch test you can do on it, so, it, uh, very well dry now, so, actually I did pour some more in there after the fact that it was a little low, that none had run out really, so, just trying to fill it up all the way so you get the idea that's the uh, wire lock 